Hello everyone, welcome to Analytics Vidya. In this video, we will see how to reverse a string using various methods. But before that, first let us understand what string is. In Python, strings are a sequence of Unicode characters. A string is basically a text or a language that we use to converse. This is an example of a string, a equal to hello. Now let us understand why we need Python reverse string. The ability to reverse and return strings is not only useful in programming, but can also come in handy in everyday life. For example, you may want to reverse the order of characters in a string to create a palindrome, or in encoding or decoding where reversing a string can help in the process. Now, there are many ways to reverse a string, but in this video, we will see three ways. How to reverse a string using a loop, using a slice operator, and using recursion. So, let's begin. Now, let's see how to reverse a string using a loop. First, we need to define the string to be reversed. And then a function named reverse string is defined, which takes a string inputs str as a parameter. After that, an empty string named reverse str is created to store the reversed version of the input string. This is followed by the for loop that is initiated to iterate through each character in the input string. Inside the loop, each character is integrated with existing reverse string. This step effectively builds the reverse string in reverse order. After the loop completes, the reverse string is written from function. Well, we have written the piece of code for the same thing. Now, we will try to run it and see the result. And as you can see, we have the output. We have put hello world and it has reversed the string. Now, let us look at the other method. Now we will see how to reverse a string using the slicing method. This line of code uses Python slicing syntax to reverse the string. The minus one slice notation means to the start from the end and move backward with the step of minus one, effectively reversing the string. The reverse string is then written from the function. Now we define an example string, input string here and call the reverse string function to get the reverse result. So now let us run this code and see what the result comes. And as you can see, we have put down the original string and it has given a reverse string as result. This is how we can use slicing method to reverse a string. Finally, we will be reversing the string using recursion. Reverse string recursive is a recursive function that takes an input string as its parameters. The base checks if the length of the string is zero or one. If true, it returns the input string as it is already reversed. In the recursive case, the function call itself with the substring starting from the second character and appends the first character at the end. This effectively reverses the string. The example usage demonstrates how to use the function by reversing the string, hello world. Now let us run the code. As you can see, the output prints the original as well as the reverse string. So that's all folks, these are the three ways you can reverse a string in Python. Subscribe to our channel for more such content. Till then, goodbye.